All right, so we'll basically replicate the exact same thing for uh, one circle and, and, and kind of one, three, two. And in the one circle, the easiest way for, for me to kind of visualize things is, is two, two three-man games here. You know, one, one of these triangles up top and then one triangle down low. Um, from a personnel standpoint, you know, I think you're much better off kind of matching your personnel and the personality that, that personnel to specific spots as opposed to kind of getting jammed up with kind of attack and, and midfield. So kind of using X's by design in, in that regard. In terms of kind of where, where we can initiate um, from within this, you know, you really can, from any of these top three spots, um, and, and then as well as, as X. And so if, if we're kind of going from this high wing, right, we're just getting a kind of a simple cut through the adjacent, he's rotating over, he's going backside, and then, and then behind. And then in terms of what you're doing um, on the backside with these, these, these players, is kind of up to you. You can just let them hang. You could have them exchange. Um, it, it really, kind of there's, there's different ways to skin the cat. It just kind of depends on what, what you want to do here. So if this player sweeps, we look at it like a little shallow cut, then he pushes this middle, we flatten out here, and then this is kind of when you get into the, the question of like, what do these guys do, right? And this is where I think you can either try to get a quick cut through, okay? Or if he just flattens out as well, then you push this backside, in which case this player then would have to then flash like that. So you've got this space covered, you've got this space covered, you've got this high wing, you've got this high wing. So he's just cutting in here. He's not trying to bring attention or, 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 or destroy this space, right? You'll have plenty of space. Um, he just has to cut through here such that we now have this player fill, so we've got this skip lane. So we've got flat, we've got an outlet behind, this guy's creeping into the high crease in case his man slides, and then we've got two natural skips. It would obviously be the exact same thing if we went from the other side. If we go from this top middle, the key here is the other two high wings need to pinch such that he can go either way. And whether these are, this is a pick or just a, a simple cut through is kind of up to you, but you have to be able to get tight to allow this player to kind of go both ways. So the one, three, two, or the one circle ends up into a two, three, one, which is basically just the exact same thing, just mirrored. The way that I kind of look at things from a philosophical standpoint on offense is um, how do you combine uh, kind of open sets with crease base sets? Um, and then how, how much transformation can you go from one formation to the next?